Oh no. It's crazy to think this was still a fairly unknown cult game when it came out. Huh. I guess it is. That's a fairly good amount of damage done to him. Ah, he does know I'm here still. Come on, forget the parry. I just want the backstab. Please. Please, game. Oh, come on, that was the back. Come on. I'm so awkward about backstabs sometimes. Sony has played to release it in the West at all. Oh, no. Silly Sony. Hey! Ultra thumbs up. Can't believe we beat him. He was so, so awkward with low health. I got his thief ring. Now I am the thief. It's now a double thief ring because I stole it. It was considered too, too hard. It didn't sell well in Japan. So Sony hesitated to release it in the West at all. It's interesting because Metal Gear Solid went the other way. Metal Gear Solid 2 has a special extra difficulty called, like, European mode. So, Metal Gear Solid actually has more difficulty in in Europe than it does in the original release in Japan, which is just kind of funny. Ancient Sapphire Ring that conceals the bearer's presence from enemies up to a distance. Cool. What did my King Ring do? Oh, less HP lost while in soul form. I kind of need it. I just killed my HP bar a little bit. Oops. So yeah, I'm, I'm glad we got it in the end. God has chosen you, Ambassador. I think um, I think we should get the this company, Blue Point, to come in and redo every Dark Souls so far, everything. Because wow, they did a good job. How cool does everything look in this remake? It is the bomb. I wonder if I can, like, just roll really well off the front here and... No, how on earth? None of the Dark Souls jump buttons do the thing. I wouldn't mind Dark Souls 1 remade in this style, for sure. That'd be, that'd be lovely. Where do I sign up? Where do I petition? Um, sure. I wouldn't say no. They did a, a, a newly dressed up new edition of all this stuff. I would be... I'd be cool with it. 
maybe I need to like find uh, a lip on this jump where I can jump down on a different side and then do a second roll onto the prize. No. I'm just going to leave that there. We're spending too much time trying to find this one item. Which is classic me style. But Keep in mind, Dark Souls 1 already had a remaster. But didn't you guys say it was terrible? Like all the colours were wrong, they removed the red fog and everything was just dreadful about it? It's mostly lightning, not a fault. Lighting, not a fault you make. Yeah. I want I want all the, like, the, all the lip sync in that these guys have done. Clearly took them a lot of time and effort. All of the different reflections and everything else. I want it all. HDR as well. You know, anything that's going to have proper HDR support, it's going to be important to me once I pick up my HDR monitor, once I finish choosing which one I'm going to get. And I think, you know, having it built into the game is better than anything that can, like, approximate oh, it. Hello. I'm here to play. This is where the ancient barbarians offered their honored heroes to the storm. To seek storms in life and meet storms in death. That was the warrior's code. But all that's left here now is a fine pile of dust. I've never been so wrong about a dig. Call myself a grave robber. I'm a disgrace. Definitely fixing the frame drops and bugs it is noble, very worthwhile. Um, you know, we we can't expect better if you have to pay full price again to buy the game a second time. Like, I got mine at a discount because I owned the original and there was a time limit on doing that. But if I miss that window and had to buy it twice to get like a, a better version, I'd feel a little bit ripped off. I'm just like, well, why didn't somebody patch the original would be my thoughts. So, yeah, the, the, the stuff they did is welcome, but surely it has to be better in a lot of ways to be worth paying again. I've never been so wrong about a dig. Yeah. I don't think this was particularly expensive. I think this was 35 instead of like the 70 that I was expecting. So that's nice. I didn't really want to pay millions for this in case I didn't like it. So far, 35's been okay. Can't believe I still have to buy Lords of the Fallen, Lies of P, and something else. I think there was another one that someone said is a, a, a Dark Souls that I need to do. I can't remember the last one, though. Wow. Mass Effect Legendary down to $10. $10. Whoa. This looks like some dead manta rays here. Which is nice. Revenge for me. Wait, does this not lead anywhere else? Where? I found a cliff. There was a cliff here. Ah, shoot. Now I've got to kill everything again. Yeah, let's wait for you to finish. Des and Sekiro first, eh? Is Des... Oh, I suppose you can't have DS1. I guess you could have DS without the one, but then maybe some people just use DS to refer to Dark Souls. Okay. So the E is the E from Demon. Right up on that wraith. He didn't. He didn't know what's coming. Yeah. Do you not? Do you not feel like I can complete these things? I actually missed a sale. 
for... Oh, cool, loot. Mr. Sale for Lords of the Fallen. That was like £22. Where I was going to get it from, and now it's back up to 25 for Lords of the Fallen. So I, I guess normally, you know, you're waiting for prices to go down, but I, I, I personally missed a, a sale on, on one of them. How cool we come this way. Oh god, skeletons. And I'm off. And they're off. So it, it evens out. You know, two of them fell off, one of me. I'm Surely I'm worth two skeletons. I mean, surely I weigh two skeletons. Probably can eventually. Yeah. I am. Um, I like this though. Like I, I, I came off of MMOs to just record anything that I missed that was good. And now I'm just like I'm a FromSoft guy. You know, I thought I was going to be playing all sorts of games, but I'm a FromSoft guy. That's what I do. Two skeletons in the bag are worth one Dean in the bush. <laughs> what am I doing in the bush? Get out of that bush, me. I guess strawberries are kind of delicious and raspberries and, and blackberries, you know, so maybe that's what I'm doing in the bush. That's how the saying goes. Yep, can't help the sayings. Just, they're gonna be what they're gonna be. This area that I'm in is so gosh dang awful. I play the Armored Core series too. Yes, I remember enjoying Armored Core on the PlayStation 1 and the PlayStation 2. I have an Armored Core upstairs somewhere. Uh, I was disappointed in the one that I brought because it was like um, it's like a PlayStation 2 game that was a like it was like a DLC for one of the other Armored Cores, but not really, as you know, you don't buy a DLC on a PlayStation 2. But it was like a standalone follow-up, I think, to another game, and it was really, really short. It was kind of disappointing, but otherwise very, very enjoyable. <laughs> I'll have to go and find the uh, the disc at some point and see which one it was. Good times, though. Oh, good one skeleton, maybe. Yep, that's right. Cartwheel off the edge. Ah. Damn, dude. 14,000 souls. I got an idea. We're going to have to head back to the, the Nexus, which hopefully won't destroy my souls. And then we're going to have to pick up one uh, Homeward Bone out of the storage. And then we're going to try and do the run again, survive, and Homeward Bone, all in one fell swoop. I'm keeping a close watch in your it's going to go terribly wrong, and I'm going to lose everything. That's the way these things go. You have a heart of gold. Yeah, um, Armored Core's good. I wonder if it plays anything like the old ones, or if they've really changed it up a load.
Okay, here we go, here we go. Be strong. Didn't put it on my hotbar. It's a bad start. Oh, and I'm standing in the area where the things can shoot me. I swear I must have done that wrong. It's nearer to this side, so I don't have to aggro everything in order to do it. So, progress as long as I don't die, maybe sort of, kind of. I hope we're all praying for me to do this correctly and not get incredibly sad. Because that's just not how I want to end my Tuesday. Lost it all. Lost it all. That is how the Tuesday ends. <laughs> oh well, now that I've lost all the souls, I can just you know go back in and play it properly and try and you know, try and win the actual rest of the level. Damn, that 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 sucks, that sucks. I um started to do light attacks rather than heavy, and then I ran out of um, stamina before I got to the end. Yeah, getting patches was, was great. Yeah, I went up to this guy, I was in so much of a hurry that I just started wailing him on lights and just ran out of stand before I could get the finisher. Ooh. Yeah, I think getting revenge on patches for some of the other games, that is pretty satisfying. And I even killed spider patches in Bloodborne. He was a spider, and it was hard. Horrifying. He had Patch's face, but he was a spider. It's gross. And now he did. I hate when this guy sees me too fast. I might try casting visibility before I drop down. From now on. It's okay. There's no souls at stake. I can get it wrong as much as I like. How freeing. <laughs> oh no, he still turns around at basically the same pace. There we go. Job done. Nope. Uh, like, it's not good to be under that heavy swing with the amount of health and stamina I have. So, what do I do? I try and move out of that swing. And he just rotates and kicks me off the side. What a badass. I fall directly on your wraith. What now? What now? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just head down this hill. Just defeat everyone on the way. It's fine. Get out of here. Nope. It didn't work how I imagined it. I, I kind of dislike this bit of level. I might need to at some point 
invest in going somewhere else other than this. I think that would be the key. Because now everywhere's open, I guess everything's like fair game for doing any any level in any order. Oh no. Okay. So when he does the finger laser, if you land on the tomb, you're kind of still at the right height for his tracking and his cast time. So you've got to not land on, on the tomb. This we know now. It's a science. Huh. I'm surprised he got me with the death laser that way. I'm kind of worried that I'm bothering this this uh, wraith man. You know, I, I literally don't ever leave him alone. I'm down here every 10 seconds at least to bother him. He's probably sick of it. Hooray! He's got a lot more health than the earlier ones. Oh my god. Why? doing it maybe oh 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 okay that's kind of horrible <laughs> god game why Wait, what? Can you not climb up that? That's an awful shame. 
Ow. Hmm. I swear I'm about to say something very unpleasant about these these mantas. Like what? Damn, there's too many in the sky to even shoot out. Even if I could be bothered to equip a bow and try doing that. Yep, the maximum down, like ultra down. But yeah, uh, I I'm I'm worried about the day that I accidentally get this wrong. Oh no, ow, 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 ow. It's worth it. It's worth using healing items. Here we go. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, for God's sake. Definitely not going to be any more enemies. I win. Come on, bonfire. That's 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 not that's not what I wanted. Done. Stream down. Right, well, that was Tuesday. We got a boss. Let it not be said that we did not get a boss. There we go, this is what we are. Soul level 29. 10 hours, 23 minutes. As a thief. At the ritual path. Yep. It sure was. Right, and the PlayStation 5 wants me to maybe just kind of do this, and then a little bit of this, and we're done. Ta-da! I think that was great. I hope the new uh, webcam placement isn't too annoying, but I, I realized that we couldn't see how many consumables I had left, which is part of the whole the whole thing. Does Dean have any potions? Let's find out by moving the webcam out of the way. I think the chat's in the right place because the souls are like at the top right instead of the bottom right and yeah i think it looks better hopefully there were no errors on the stream and everything continues to look really really cool but i am so hungry i'm gonna go off and make the rest of my cajun chicken and i hope everyone has a wonderful tuesday so thumbs up and goodbye see you soon we're here every weekday we have a discord and youtube and you know all the, all, all the stuff you know that bit where you have to occasionally mention that you have websites. You can come have some of mine. I, I actually make a really nice korma. So, you know, anytime you want to stop on by, we can have chicken korma. I'll cook it in the slow cooker.